one being a representing a man for Uptown TV. You understand? Chop. What go on, people? Big up on yourself. You know where they are again. Cutting it, styling at the night time, you know, man. So, yeah, what go on, man? Big up on yourself as always. You see me? Yeah, man. And you know we there. Yeah. So, you don't know what you have to do. Because you don't know. Get your coffee. Get your matches stick. You see what I say? Catch up your eye. You don't know we are going to deal with the stepping razor in the night. Yeah. You see what I say? In a real time. Mm -hmm. And you don't know what the thing come down already, people. Why if he come down, but you don't know that thing they go already. Yeah, me I say, just do nothing here, man. Like, you know, so we bring the argument. Yeah. And for some people where I say, we are post motor baroka, brother, what you fi do is to share the knowledge, yo. Share the knowledge and stop from going like, say, you yeah, try to make get a youth feel away about me posting the actual knowledge. What you want to do? Make the, make the knowledge alone sit down in the area of him. Oh, I'm telling you, some of the people, if you go away, man, the people them who check in and know, so them get the knowledge and them get the topic without the advertisement and all of these things. I know, so we are putting the work and I bring the knowledge, brother. Big up to you, you see me? But for the haters, them who are say, we are chop up this and chop up that, me bring the program to you in a real time. You see me? Me not alter nothing. You see me? Me not cut up nothing. Me just bring it to you straight forward so me forget some love you see me me not lie really and truly i saw it thing go people long inch but you don't know we never want to do that but we just want to see that quick and fast so you don't know like share and subscribe is it mm -hmm. is the cutting edge again i ref him rain kaiser ease up you know he's getting warm you know we just listen to the launch there, a master Griffith 68th anniversary show. May I tell you, say, for your sister, you know, this thing after 60 years, among so much money, you know. She stand up, may I tell you, she stand up for 60 years. Not before, all of them artists were about the place where claim said they're number one. Born, they never born yet. When she had make it. Why you are up, you know? Because she really stand up. She truly is the queen of reggae. That me have to say. I'm a really feel good for no say. Me have the opportunity to carry her go to the studio. Go record her. She and Judy Moat. Me feel good and she depend almost everyone on my album them. Yeah, man. Marsha Griffiths do back up vocal pan most of my album them if it's even a like one tune and this one where we are play a week here i go to the studio and go produce this tune here woman have to get to now you may have seen Mali. you know say so holy power never hear this yet i've ever played for her i mean no say so shall listen right now here goes tune where by the way, as you talk about that, we're going to play a tune by him too. With she and my, even in my mass, yeah. A bob on the birthday Monday, you know. Yes. He might be 80. He would be 80 years old if he was alive. Bob Andy. The artist who write every song we write for Marcia Griffiths. It. Every song. And that one, yeah, it for the two of them. Especially in England. Bob Andy and Marcia Griffiths. With Nina Simone, big big song. Sleep away. Anyway, look here now. A twist of Mali. Listen. Here we go. Decrease you or neutralize you. That is why you need to be very serious about your association. So check your relationship because when wrong people live your life wrong things will stop happening some of you your life is full of drama but it is because of the people you have in your life tell your neighbor let them go come on look at your neighbor say neighbor when wrong people live your life wrong things stop happening when toxic people live your life 
toxic things stop happening. And listen to me, one thing you need to know about wrong association, they will kill your joy. Wrong associations will kill your passion. Wrong association will kill your dream. Wrong association will kill your faith. Wrong associations will kill your drive. Don't make everybody your friend. And some of you are trapped in the wrong relationship because you are saying you don't understand. I have history with this person but listen to me just because you have history with somebody doesn't mean you have a future with somebody hey tell your neighbor neighbor just because we have history that doesn't mean we have a future and i came to announce to somebody your destiny is not commanded you to make everybody your friend love is a must but relationship is by choice. Anybody that is not making you better, that is making you bitter, let them go. Even on Facebook, it's not everybody that you have to accept their request. Hey, some people you must delete. You are the CEO of your life. You are the CEO of your life. You are the CEO of your life. You have the right to invite, delete, and terminate. Yes. As a warning, <laughs> people in your life. Now, we have been playing this next clip many times, but every time I play it, somebody like somebody new hear it. I want to hear it again. And every time I play it, I have to play it again. So here we go. It's about animal rights. Animal rights. I should have a top 10 charts of them clips, you know. And the, the ones that were, I get requests for most, we just play it like a top 10. You understand? Like, them have top 10 music. Anyway, Animal Rights, here you go. Philip Wollon. Well, King Lear, late at night on the cliffs, asks the blind Earl of Gloucester, how do you see the world? You see, I heard the screams of my dying father as his body was ravaged by the cancer that killed him. 90% of the small fish are ground up into pellets to feed to livestock. Vegetarian. It is a crime against humanity of unimaginable proportions. WW was a stuck keyboard. Cloud was in the sky. 4G was a parking space. Google United States. They will need $8 trillion invested in treasury bills just to pay the interest. And they have precise. If everyone ate a Western diet, we would need two planet Earths to feed us. We've only percent greater than transport, as Peter said. Cars, trains, buses, ships, lorries, the whole lot. Had glass walls, we wouldn't be having this debate tonight. You see, I believe another world is possible. I did it there for a while ago. <laughs> All right. So here goes, here goes, here goes, here goes. Congo, six. Over six million people have died in the Democratic Republic of the Congo so that we in the Western world can benefit from its resources. Congo is extremely rich in gold, diamond, percent of the Earth's coltan, a precious mineral that is needed for our modern electronics like iPhones iPads, computer, on and on. In 1946, the Strategic Minerals Stockpiling Act was passed to obtain and stockpile cobalt, strategic and critical mineral that is essential for our aerospace, military, and defense industries. As the United States and the United Kingdom provide financial aid and military aid to countries such as Rwanda and Uganda, these neighboring countries plunder Congo's natural resources as the death toll rises. In four studies, the United Nations implicated multinational companies in sourcing coltan from Congo, stating that these companies serve as the engine of the conflict in the DRC. As the world benefits from Congo's riches, Congolese men, women, and children continue to be raped, tortured, starved, displaced, and killed. In 2010, a leaked United Nations report cited 
crimes of genocide may have been committed by the Rwandan troops. There is very little media coverage on what is actually happening in Congo. When Congo is covered by the media, it is often about rebel groups committing mass atrocities. What these reports do not cover are the funding, training, and the arming of these rebel groups by foreign governments. Nothing is ever mentioned about the Western-backed coups, wars, assassinations, or the involvement of foreign corporations in the looting of Congo. 48 women are raped every hour. Millions are displaced. Over 6 million dead. Half are children under the age of 5. What is happening in Congo is a silent holocaust. Serious thing. Can you believe that? I will not hear them thing there, you know. We don't hear them thing there, the news over here, so, you know. You know how much people, man, you know where that, that, that far? Coltan, you know what is Coltan? Is it in a day computer, the iPhone, the iPad, and all them something there? They have children where them used to dig up that to make it reach cross where we there, so now. And the world stand up and watch all these things. You know, we had a little voice that I made a while ago, and I said, watch out. It's our little button I never push up, you know. <laughs> we don't have nothing to sleep on that program, you know. It's our little button we don't push up. But we will continue the journey. We will continue the journey. Here goes. Yeah. The more everybody said them is American. No African-American. I try to get out the Africa out of way again. It's like what them call in a Jamaica, West Indian. And we are no Indian. Them say West Indian. Because Columbus make a mistake. He thought that he was in India. Because he was traveling west. He thought that he was in India. And when him look upon the people them and see the picture and the drawing them where him have, him said this must be India. And he must travel in West. Him said this is the West of India. We all know where the majority of the people who call themselves Jamaican come from. And we insist, we insist of using where European give up to define ourselves and call ourselves West Indian. I sort of name, except African. Most Jamaican people feel to say them African. Because them say them never got Africa yet. Yet still, if a cow born in a pig pen, them don't call the cow pig. Because them don't give up him features biologically or otherwise. A cow is a cow anywhere the cow born. Africa is an, an African is an African anyway in ball. So that is why them have we get up a morning time and I eat breakfast. And in the afternoon we eat lunch. And in the evening we eat dinner. And when we go to the bed, we try to get something to eat. Yes. And I will a man when him don't have sex, him start smoke. <laughs> it's for hard smoke cigarette. In the bed, a madness. Ah, the madness of them have we had though. Yeah, man, madness we have we had And we have said, no cigarette smoking in my room or anywhere by my compound. That's what I see it. <laughs> we can't do much tonight. Yeah. We're going to take some phone call after the next ad them. Because, you know, there's some more ad them out to play. So, we're going to take some call after the next ad them. But meanwhile, we're going to do this. As we have said, no cigarette smoking in here. Yes. He like jumping. You want your next one? Here we go. Here we go. Where the cat? Uh, Almost 10. Yeah. Speak, I'm man. I'm going to say, I don't make so much people are dead, man. You ask me that. I know me I kill them. I know that. The way I ask me that for man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, I want to say something to us. Yeah. Say it, man. When, make, when it near, always near for election, 
Bueno, bueno. ¿cómo explico, Ale? Bueno, si se le empare este channel, no, no, everything we are going on in Russia. So why they would I want people then? They don't, they don't make no sense. I might lose that to kill them. Yeah, but why they would I want the people them dead? More, one man get more vote, man. One man get less vote, and one man get more vote. So we have to know. So like the five people, they dead are there. I wish one kill them. Which party kill them? The, 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 the one them are dead. Yeah, who for, yeah. who for party them is? One of the party them now appear to be you know. No, but you say, why you feel say, what are the parts of them who are the murder we are going to go on? Because they want to run up on TV, come push up them seats and, and chat all kind of little things and all of them know who are going on. You know, I don't believe that. that. I don't believe that. I don't believe that, Trista. I don't believe that. I come up on TV. Yeah, um, uh, yeah, I come up on the government. We have a month, you know. Mm. Some local people, some local people, we are going like say them love, them love, but them love, you know. Yeah. Call them a deal with some, some, some hypocritical things around, around the corner. Like what? So? Like what? They suit what? themselves. They suit themselves. When they feel like the man gets free amount of something. And okay. the man come on TV. I'm, a long time that I go on from, from all the, in, in, in the Edward Shaga days, you know. Remember the whole part, whole part, whole part, whole part, whole part, whole part. Yeah, they are killed for political, I, yeah, the whole land. They are killed politically, but if you say five men get shot, so, some people get shot in a Clarendon the other day, and you have to tell me now, say a politician want that happen. Who are want to say this, man? Because they want to come on TV and uh, come show themselves and skin up. Them, and you know, but what them not forget people dead for go on TV. Them name politicians them can't go up on TV any time. Them not make people yeah, them them not go up on it any time. They don't go up on it certain time when certain things are going on. So yeah. why they must go up on TV all the while make it to them? Yeah. That's so what they want. So they have to make things happen to them company. And come right, tell sir. all kind of lie and story and, and, and talk all kind of thing. All right, sir. I said, I said, what do you about this? I can't think of it, what do you matter about? I'm foolish, man, I'm foolish. I'm foolishness, foolishness, foolishness. It's either yeah. you talk about national hero, you're going to try to create something else now to put some other people like, no, national hero, we're going to talk about, national straight. Yeah, straight up. Yeah, them no, think no, no, too much, man. That's that international, long, 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 long them time. Them think too much. Them think too much. Them are think yeah. too much. I'm from, 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 Imagine <laughs> Them have eighty percent of people. Yeah. So them what? want the eye can thing and to go on and when I went interview some people on TV, them say them no want eye can, them want hear your thing. But most people don't want eye can thing. Naturally, yeah. you want them to talk about them come with this eye can thing. Yeah, baby chum, baby chum, and them friend them want come bring that up you now. Yeah. Yeah, really? Yeah. Yeah. It's like how oh, I the man said, like the mother want to change out, you know, African American. Yeah, and I talk about American, everybody American. Yeah. Losing That's your right. identity, like, lose, it can't work, yes, America, it name. You know, people are in India. But we as Af Af African Nago respect that and work with that. Then, how oh, we have respect, how oh, we have work with Indian, so we are West Indian. 
होगा वो कोई लाभ वो जो निकाल चले मावे You know, I'm not African identity, but I'm not in that because the Chinese have the Chinese are call themselves West Indian. They say my China man in a Jamaica. Anyway, in there. Yeah, anyway, yeah, they're not changing. My Chinese. Uncle black people they are talking about them are West Indian. They are this, they are that, and they are also them African. Yeah, who is? Hmm. Who is? All right, sir. I want to say to Mama Fire and Papa Fire, all them them thing they go. I don't, I don't hear no more about it. I don't hear no more about it. All right? All right. Yeah, man, give time. And then Zinga, and Zinga thing too. I don't hear no more about that neither. I say, the lawyer bridging more. I deal with vice cartel thing and all, so I don't know where I go on this, so. All right? Yeah, yeah. I go tell them what's fine out, though. I go tell Shamara them, if give me a run up and where I go on. I'm going to ask you one thing, yeah. One morning I'm Peter Pan 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 Rio still like calling my Bob Marley, you know. Oh, they don't talk to them. You don't call them and talk to them. Uh, are you you have powers near them? No, uh, no, 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 no. We have to me have these powers. Call yeah, them and talk to them. The most of the day, you know, I share that reason in the too. I get some people for call them too. The more people call them, the more they think about it. Yeah, please. I don't know. I'm on the I'm on the yeah. server. I look at I look yeah. at that. I look at time. The point of view. Yeah, yeah. They're my icon, man. All right, we have to move. Yeah. Welcome home. Mm-hmm. Welcome home. Yeah, Papa. All right, love, man. Yeah, bless you, man. More protection. Right. Yeah. Places where we wouldn't expect it. All right, make us start over. Make us start over this. Make us start over. It is everywhere. We need it. We want it. We even find it in places where we wouldn't expect it. When researchers examined the stomach of a beached sperm whale in 2012, they found 30 square meters of tarpaulin, a four and a half meter long hose, a nine meter long plastic rope, and two flower pots. How is this possible? On average, a European uses and disposes of more than 100 kilograms of plastic per year. A large part of plastic waste ends up on huge landfills or in the sea. Today, more than 100 million tons of plastic is drifting around the oceans. Due to particular currents in the Pacific Ocean, a new continent has been born. A mass of plastic waste the size of Europe. In some areas of the oceans, there is up to 60 times as much plastic as there is plankton. Because plastic does not rot, it lasts up to 500 years. Through exposure to sun, wind, and water, plastic is broken down into microscopic parts. These plastic particles can absorb high concentrations of agricultural and industrial toxins. Many animals mistake the plastic for plankton and eat their fill. Every year, more than a hundred thousand turtles, marine mammals, and seabirds die a slow and painful death because they starve with a full stomach, or because their intestines rupture. Other marine creatures in whose cells plastic and toxins have accumulated end up as seafood on our plates. The smallest form of plastic are microplastics. They are added to cosmetics, shower gels, and toothpastes. A tube of toothpaste contains up to 10% microplastics. The sewage plants cannot filter microplastics, so they too end up in the sea. In the making of plastic, hazardous chemicals are used in order to enhance elasticity of fire resistance. Bisphenol A, plasticizers, or flame retardants, are contained in almost every plastic product. Through exposure to heat, the wrong detergents, or simply over time, plastic will go brittle, thus releasing these chemicals, which in turn, through the airways, ingestion, or through mere touch, find their way into the human body. The consequences are severe. They include increased risk of cancer, asthma, infertility, and developmental disorders. The plastic industry tries to cover up any scandals 
and runs a gigantic lobbying campaign in order to prevent stricter laws or inquiries. Plastic factories are veritable fortresses. The plastic production process a tightly kept secret. This is one of the reasons why no one is exactly sure what substances are added to the plastic. Over the course of the last 10 years, only 11 chemical substances could be analyzed out of a total of 100,000 possible additives. But there is hope yet. Intelligent robot nets, or fishing boats, converted to floating recycling factories are intended to cleanse the oceans. Bioplastic made of maize or starch could replace conventional plastic. However, its production consumes valuable food, so it's no solution for satisfying the global demand for plastic. This is why you must radically change your consumption behavior. Pay attention to the packaging of products. Substitute paper or cloth bags for plastic bags. Don't throw away old plastic, but recycle it and use plastic-free products. Are we going to allow the destruction of the Earth to continue? If we act now, there may still be hope for future generations, before the miracle material definitely turns on its creator. Sea rusting. Sea rust, sea rusting. You see, all these things you have to think about them, you know. You can't just go on light, you know. You are listen and not hear. You understand? Or you are hear and not listen. Because some people hear enough things you know, about them not listen. So them kind of keep repeating the same thing all the while and expect to get a different result. But we all are run from, well, not we, but young people especially are run from what you call examination we examine things and come up with a, a reasoning why you accept that thing some people do have to examine things and just argue about things where them do have to understand find the most christian do that them argue about things where them do have to understand some of them are quote the bible and don't even know which part of the bible them read it because they never read it in the bible they hear the pastor say it or the granny say it from a long time. So you have people that quote the Bible like say so them really read it. Most Jamaicans do that. And I will them hear them grandmother or mother say from a long time. And that they must say. If you ask them which part of the Bible they them say, no, it's not the Bible. I remember. So we keep doing things I expect to get a different result. And we keep doing the same thing all the while, the same way. And not no go so. Because if you know, go one way, you have to try another way. And if you go the next way, you have to try another way. You can't just keep doing the same thing all day, all night, all year, all your life. And that is where I will put one upon track. Them trick them upon track for you. You have a grown hog there. <laughs> grown hog there. Them upon track, man. They might live over the same miserable life for them used to have when they was young. And them keep regurgitating it. The life we are talking about. So look at all the youth them now. The youth them just are dead, so. And it's not disease that kill them. It's one and another, they might kill one another. They might kill themselves. Car, drugs. You have more old people. You have more old people in Jamaica than young people, and them, them need a young force for work. But if the young people them are dead off, what happened? And the problem is that young people, a man, I drive a car reckless, and I'm not feeling him can crash. And the point, sometimes him, him crash, and nothing not happened to him, and the person him crashing are dead. Wake up, black people. Anyway, we will take the 12 o'clock in Jamaica. It's 12 o'clock in Jamaica. Brother. Still, 
Claro, il est Speak. Yeah, blessed. I remember. Yeah. Yeah, man, I'm there, I'm out there. You hear you, man? Yeah. That's an motor. Motor, the rule of them so wicked, man. You ask me that. That's I don't mean much to talk. I don't mean much to talk, man. Why, Bertrand? Come like everywhere you go. I mean, if I tell you about the one where do a red gathering at all, may I tell you? May I look longer if you see if Mr. People are swim. I don't know is what kind of road them that. Like. Yeah, so what the I'm on I'm on drop off on bicycle and bicycle and drown it. You know one of the whole them. Yeah, you know, in a patrol. No, me not ta- me, well yeah, patrol you attack. Uh, no I don't know where I go on. But me never see me never see Jamaica infrastructure deteriorate. Well, the you know, in a hard car, it's a man there. So I drive up town and me barrack. What day me I drive I come from Papi? You hear me? Yeah, me I hear you. From Hope Road. See, before you come down at the embassy there. I tell you, sir. Dropping our big road to them, me I tell you now. Whoa, 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 Okay. Well, that uh, man will call the program so much time right there. Bridget, what kind of thing that? The man call the program so much time and I go answer. He's offline. Yeah, He's yeah, offline. yeah, yeah, man, it's all right. Give thanks. Wow. Bridget, if you are listening to me, I hear you call the program, you know, Bridget. You use your card program. Oh, the man. Oh, the man reaches. So, anyway, I'm going to go and play it. So, how, what's the solution? So, how do we get that? That's well, here's the thing. See, we got to recognize that wealth is intergenerationally created. Most people who get rich don't get rich in a lifetime. Oprah, that's once in a while. Bill Gates, that's once in a while. Most people are intergenerational wealth. That means what? That if black people want to catch up, we have to start saving wealth and passing it to the next generation. Our biggest problem ain't that we're splurging is that every time we splurge, we're stealing from our descendants. You're giving them no inheritance to get started with. But the white child, they're starting out $100,000 plus, a million million dollars plus. And I think we have to become more strategic in the way that we do our health plans as well as our life insurance plans. Because what I'm learning with a lot of these white folk, a lot of them are getting their first, uh, uh, what you want to call a shock of wealth, through the life insurance so, policy they are, of their they are, parents. Yeah, we, we, we talk about that. Too. Yeah, yeah, so life there, insurance policy. Yeah. Yeah. So there's so many different strategies towards wealth that we're not even thinking about because black people, our selfishness, it's also based on our, what you want to call it, emergency consciousness, survival instinct. We're only worried about our life. We do not think about those who come after us. Now, you got to realize now, when we got out of slavery, white folks been already building wealth for a couple centuries. Right, right. We started behind the eight ball. Okay, so you got to play catch up. How do you catch up with somebody who's 100 yards in front of you? You have to run faster than they are. That means we have to sacrifice our spending habits more than everyone else in order to catch up. How does a people who are at the bottom waste money more than people who are at the top? So not only are you not catching up, you're not even thinking about trying to catch up. Um, We this is good. And we got a thousand questions. Mm. We know you. Yes, my top old. Wealth, I know black people don't know how to leave wealth for the future generation. We spend too much and borrow too much and can't pay for it. Wealth, the other nation, them know how to do that. That is why I see them control so much things and then them pick the community. Serious thing. Dean Fraser. Africans. It's time to wake up and realize the power within you. For far too long, religion has often been used to obscure the light of truth and limit your potential. As a diverse continent with a rich history and culture, it's crucial to recognize the ways in which religion can sometimes keep you in the dark. 
Religion has played a significant role in the lives of many Africans, providing comfort, guidance, and a sense of community. However, it's important to acknowledge that certain religious practices can also perpetuate harmful beliefs, foster division, and limit critical thinking. It's time to critically examine the role of religion in your lives and society. See what's saying. We will play that again, you know. We will play it again. Dear Africans, it's time to wake up and realize the power within you. For far too long, religion has often been used to obscure the light of truth and limit your potential. As a diverse continent with a rich history and culture, it's crucial to recognize the ways in which religion can sometimes keep you in the dark. Religion has played a significant role in the lives of many Africans, providing comfort, guidance, and a sense of community. However, it's important to acknowledge that certain religious practices can also perpetuate harmful beliefs, foster division, and limit critical thinking. It's time to critically examine the role of religion in your lives and society. Okay. Time, yo. Check it out. Listen, listen, listen. The way things are supposed to work is the government should know virtually nothing about us because we're private citizens. We're supposed to know everything about the government because they're public servants. But everything is backward right now. And also look at the media. The media is supposed to be giving us the facts and we should be formulating our opinions based on that information. Instead, the media gives us their opinions and we're supposed to decipher whether that's a fact or not. Uh, listen, listen. Here we go. Christianity and Islam by nature, they are bullies of African culture. It is expressed in their intolerance of other people who believe differently from who they are. So here's a simple example. If a Muslim walks into this village, the first object is to build a mosque and make everyone in that village a Muslim. Mm -hmm. It changes your timetable of waking up. You wake up at five, changes your fashion, how you what changes the way you bury your loved ones. Now you must have to do everything according to the Islamic law. The same thing is true with Christianity. Christianity walks into a space, first thing they want to do is a Zulu, is a closer. You take off your shirt and put on your beautiful beads, mm -hmm. Hebrew beads, by the way, which are Jewish. <laughs> you put on your Hebrew gear, which is traditional, and you walk up to church. Christianity will look at you. We, though now there's a bit of tolerance, mm -hmm. but the, the first glance is, is unacceptable because the God that Christianity has does not have tolerance for culture. Does not rather I would rather take off that thing, I put on your shirt, I put a tie on you, put a jacket, polish your shoes, and says, now you look nice. <laughs> because apparently you must become European first mm. before you can become Christian. In, in order for God to accept you, He cannot accept you in your authenticity. You, he needs first to take you through the culture of the dominant culture, which is a colonial culture, before you can actually become an acceptable Christian. It, it, an intelligent conversation needs to take place where we say, is everything that we are doing in the Christian church Christian? Or some of the things, norms, and rituals that we are performing are actually European culture, but now they have been couched mm. and packaged as Christianity. The way we sing, for example, the way we dress, for example, the way we eat, for example, the way we celebrate our things, our holidays, our festivals, mm -hmm. our, 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 our Passovers, and etc. Are, are these things be Easter's? Are these things biblical? Christmases? You have a lot of faith. Believe in yourself, man. That is the point. The worst evil people tend to be religious people. Because if they can't control you, they will quote the Bible and use that to control you. Highly religious people will say things like, God told me. Well, great. He can tell me. I prayed about it. Who did you talk to? Satan will abuse the Bible and religious people will weaponize the Bible to control you. and use that to control you. Highly religious people will say things like, God told me. Well, great, he can tell me. I prayed about it. Who did you talk to? Satan will abuse the Bible and religious people will weaponize the Bible to control you. One in three people will not make it to 65. Subway. Reports showed that their bread had a chemical used in production of yoga mats and shoes. 
Their fresh vegetables are, in fact, usually near expiration. Taco Bell. Their lettuce is treated with permethrin, which is a pesticide known to cause neurological damage. Not that appealing anymore, is it? McDonald's. Their buns are made of 32 synthetic ingredients that are also used for producing car tires. The FDA tries to hide this as much as possible. Five Guys. 23 ingredients in their burger are flavor enhancers that cause headaches and anxiety. Just looking at the burger makes me want to vomit. Let me guess. You keep finding yourself eating fast food all the time. It tastes good, but let me tell you, when your arteries are clogged, you're going to wish you stayed away. Remember, there's a better life out there. So, will you stop your addiction to fast food? Will you? <laughs> Big question that some people can't cook. Especially the female, they have no idea. They don't have a cooking business. They more not have a restaurant. I carry them go to TST or Kentucky. It's crazy. What I'm to the good old home cooking days that gone. The richest man in China said, if you put the bananas and money in front of the monkeys, the monkeys will choose bananas because the monkeys don't know that money can buy a lot of bananas. In fact, if you offer work and business to people, they will choose to work. Because most people don't know that a business can make more money than a salary. One of the reasons the poor are poor is because the poor are not trained to recognize the entrepreneurial opportunity. They spend a lot of time in school and what they learn in school is to work for a salary instead of working for themselves. Profit is better than wages, because wages can support you, but profits can make you a fortune. What's your opinion? Yes, what's your opinion? Hey, we still have to take the phone call, you know, but, you know, them really, all right, we don't have to see what we have to say, but we still have to take the phone call, them. Oh, we want to play about this thing, we want to play about this thing, you know. You know, if, if you can't play about music, you must can't play about something else. Really the richest man in China said, if you put the bananas and money in front of the monkeys, the monkeys will choose bananas because the monkeys don't know that money can buy a lot of bananas. In fact, if you offer work and business to people, they will choose to work because most people don't know that a business can make more money than a salary. One of the reasons the poor are poor is because the poor are not trained to recognize the entrepreneurial opportunity. They spend a lot of time in school and what they learn in school is to work for a salary instead of working for themselves. Profit is better than wages because wages can support you, but profits can make you a fortune. Singapore, oh, there is no trash. Every day, over 2,400 trucks collect all the garbage and dump it in the bunker. There are four waste incineration plants across the country to burn trash 24 hours a day, seven days a week, three, 65 days a year. The fire burns the trash in these factories and the heat generated from this process becomes electricity to light up homes. The toxic smoke is filtered out and becomes super clean. The remaining ash, which they call new sand, is taken to a man-made island, which they soon plan to use for non-structural construction like pathway bricks. You hear that? You hear that? Listening you know, it bewilders me. Every argument that Westerners yes. make to substantiate their claim that their so-called civilization is superior, every argument is materialistic. We have nice things. We invented all the technology of the modern world and so on. You don't realize that when you make that argument to the global south, where we're living in the background where all that technology comes from. It comes from our minerals, our rare earths, our mines, our ravaged environments, and our subjugated labor. We're living in the part of the Apple logo where the bite is. So that doesn't impress anyone in Africa. Africa or Asia or Latin America, you have nice stuff. Yeah, we know how you got it. We know how you got it. And it wasn't by brilliance, it was by brutality. It was then and it is now. So you should really stop using that argument. It's self incriminating. Yeah. Turn off your radio. Turn off your radio. Turn off. Yeah. Hey, Lisa. Hey, man. 
Yeah, my um, respect to us, but I heard you school. And um, Monday, but this time last time in the army. What are you talking about? The Raspal. Me who? The Raspal. Oh, you know his name, though? See it I get bigger and bigger. A one lane traffic now. A pass long there now, you know. The way the whole big and wide and long. Who, who asked all the money? Who get the money? What what they does with the money, Mota? 
can somebody who intelligent enough explain that to me? Because when I look at the thing out of rock rock, we used to take the other bus to half a tree, go out and we go boom. And these days, and I change motor. The thing can still down there, motor. Not no change. Still these days, I transform it. Live still there. Still there. A man can't live chill down. I never let him move. And these people just get worse. Huh? Oh, you say worse? W-R-S-E or W-R-S-T? What's a raw? What's a raw? What's a raw? All right, so we have a tree worse there. Motor. Them places are in poo. But no, 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 Wildman Street and them, Street. and them look worse than when we used to live down there. <laughs> worse. But I tell you, you know, the only thing I keep a lot of people in Jamaica is you know, car you and Jerry. Because you know. I, 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 in fact, I, 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 Monday I come from the airport to the bridge and they make him know, say, when I talk about bad place, the bad place, the morning of you and, and, and work. I, and on Monday and night, people come dead and People dead. Mm, and I play five. football, how much people get shot and Five died. people, five people, I'm saying. But yes, the motor, nobody can say a John Brown or so and so, the man come for me. So people are dead, you know. A motor I don't want to so, for the football, but we're looking at that, you know. But them not say one, they must them shoot one, they must have them, them shoot one. I call out name, you know. Yeah, they must have them shoot one of them. Both of them can't say anything. Me and I assist him, you didn't assist him, so me, no. If the motor is near in a war, I kill a son yeah. or somebody for you five years ago. And yeah. you keep a peace thing. The man them never said the people in Martha. Nobody now just run up and come shoot up work at the motor. And yeah. man come and you can't say, you know, say, a John Brown, a Tom, a Tom Peter from so and so. Usually the police will say, John Brown, come to the police station. Peter, come to nothing. You see, it's that man get shot, the motor. When you shot and kill that man now, all him all the information, when they gone from one was in the shoot car. Obviously, it was the one man did that. You know? oh, so when you kill man. him now, all you get information, I say to the man just a run up and down like a chicken head. Hold to motor. You kill a man. You have this mass shooting, this every day you hear people are here chatting you. See a man and you kill him. Why not correct the man, call the man and tell the man sorry now and then kill me and say, well, all right. Tell you how you get the gun, who get the gun, mm-hmm. why he leave man and No, you yeah, know, them policemen, they don't know when they're surrounding, you know. Them policemen, they don't know nothing about surrender. The way I talk about man, and surrender. They, 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 they don't have no leader. Come here, the prime minister answer some questions from overseas. And the man might say, why you have said black soldier, our soldier are here to abuse our yeah. black people then. Yeah. When they don't get abused by white people and exploit. Here, the prime minister, no? Oh, I check because guns coming in from here to the big educated parents that said guns coming in from here to the motor. Can somebody tell me any one of these men from Coast Guard with an Asian boat with gun and I? Are we char are we having a body from Haiti that to catch with gun? The gun them come from America. America the gun them are from. Motor. Yeah. Okay, you know, we we're a man from here the Haiti that we know this thing though. The country, all of them guys, they look go up a university, go learn how to scam. That's how yeah. the man going to politics motor with lean up boot. Not it. A man who, the whole of St. Thomas, man who big hardware, man a big, big skyscraper, building mm. down a boomer. Yeah, man, man I get man. Man, up until the Prime Minister motor here, let me tell you again, mm. Andrew Wall is not Mark Golden. Do not come and tell Jamaican people how they are going to divide the land because. After COVID, no more I thought we would have a, a rapid, I would have a massive farming spree, no, a farming drive. No, no. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to on tourists, no more yeah. time. And the food, they are coming with them, yeah. them get lights, they bring in. And you know, what I'm, you know what? When I, when I, when I act up, nature lick Jamaica again, and they are, are, are a virus, and the hotel, them can't open. We we'll go back to square one because we never still never a plant, still never a plant. Motor, you see the water, my spring spring up. You see the water, my spring spring up. 
Mm. And I'm going to come and talk about what's going to affect me and where we'll be a part of it. I'm not being no part of no white boy. War. Mm. Uh, white boy, no war, we are the members. White boy, no war, we are ever so. The war, we are ever. I'm not going to be a part of no white boy. War. And John and Fred, we're getting money, go and do that. Yeah. No fight with no shy rock now. Do that because Mota, you say them war can't see them. Watch if you know some man I hold on man and yeah, man. We should have left on a drive now, Mota, the pure farming. Farm. Farm, of course. Educate the youth. And you know when no election has come, yeah. you have water now. You have pray, pray there last in four much years from PJ time. You have up them allocate for so much a billion now. You have a pint. Water now. For Pacho. Let Mota hold on them a rob farm. Why does no true election come? I feel like the party wall in back election. I said, I'm the most used. I'm not a plan motor. I'm the farm. I'm the farm of the most used for watch them own thing. And get the farm of them gun. Thank you, motor. They forget the farm of them some gun. And that may tell them money. I see. I'm talking about them. Simply, you give the farm of them gun and make the police answer. Yeah, man. Get the farm of them, them lies gun. Why is it not a party? I tell you, I listen more. Why have a party in a Beverly? I've gone and showed you. For them, like, more important than you and me and Cabo. Why well, you know more than me, man? The people in my church, God, every one of them have gone. Most of almost everyone. Most of them have gone. One party, some. All right, we'll have to move. 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 Break time. Strive to shatter the chains of occupation and tyranny of suffering and torment. The birth of Israel in 1948 from their ancestral homes and land. All right, now. That is Malcolm X speaking from another 60s. That is Malcolm X speaking about something right now where they're upon the front burner. So we will start it again. The Palestinians. El Muta. Oh, yeah, man. Blessed. Yeah, blessed. Um, listen, a another racist miscarriage of justice Monday, the 21st, at the old BLA in London. Mm. What well, no. Yeah. Um, Chris Caba, who was shot dead. Just after midnight on the 6th of September 2022 in Streatham, South London, near where Earl Wyalindo used to live, um, the, the police officer, Martin Blake, M-A-R-T-Y-N, Blake, 40, was acquitted of his murder and reinstated in the police force. Is that white when, man? Yes. Yes, oh, yes, is that yeah. And when um he, he, Chris Cabba, twenty four years old, he was in a car which the police said had been involved in some gang related shooting the night before. A RD Q eight. And he was boxed in a street, so he couldn't go anywhere. He in the car and this police guy, Martin Blake shot him, one shot to the head while his hand was on the steering wheel. Cold-blooded murder. Mm -hmm. And he was let up on Monday the 21st. So they have no demonstration? Well, you know said that is going to happen. Mm -hmm. Because Saturday morning is going to be make it, I think, 20 years of um, an annual demonstration them have about police killing Africans in Britain and um, people and that type of thing. So what so, was the police argument? What was the, about the youth? What was the police the, argument? The police boy claimed that he felt threatened oh. by, by Skaba. How did he feel threatened when the youth hand was on the steering wheel? He mm. couldn't go forward, he couldn't go backward. He was boxed in the street, surrounded by armed officers. And you shoot him through the windscreen, one shot in I made. And his parents, naturally, and supporters are saying that this has shown that the racism whereby African life do not matter, the injustice, and that they're going to fight to clear them son's name 
And yeah. what the police have been doing and them supporters is saying, oh, Chris Caba was a big criminal and involved with shooting and all type of things and so, oh, you know, to discredit. Ma- ma- uh, yes, yes. Wicked, wicked, wicked man. At the whole BLA. And I endorse the bridge, you know, when I talked to you a while ago about the non-fixing of roads in Jamaica. I just say a carpenter, them I use. Them not yeah, fixing man. the road. This yeah. has always been some water from before me and you even born. But it's worse Europe now. That. Worse now. Because first of all, it's a country road now, the main road, them. The main yeah. asphalt road, them, I dig up. Terrible, yeah. man. And, and, and as you say, Kinson Technical, where we used to go, James's Street, Wildman Street, yeah. all of them streets there. Worse, worse now. Worse. You know what Worse. 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 Wildman Street takes lane. Well, yeah, all of them streets are worse than in our time where we are going to the Calvary 60s. Go around to Franklin you know? Town. Franklin Town. See them here. Yeah. Are worse than when me used to know about Franklin Town. When me have run up and down yeah. Franklin Town. Rallington Town. I, I, exactly. We remember in the 60s all Cumberland Road and Franklin yeah. Town. The road smooth and nice and everything. May I tell you? Eh? Somebody now build oh, something right. All of them things there. The roads them did good. And then I do want to talk about guns that come from Haiti. The guns them coming from the USA. And I do want to try to take African people in Jamaica for Haiti. Yeah. They made and come from the USA. And yeah. before I deal with the gangs and the political corruption, in a Jamaica, he might talk about gangs in a Haiti, eh? To help the racist USA and them type of thing there, eh? you know? Yeah, right. Yeah, but <laughs> wicked. And, and, me I play a dance a lot of you know? Um, mm. Latimer Road, the, this Friday I come here, the 25th. And okay. it's happened to be the birthday of the first sound system man in Britain. Uh, wow, you, Vin, who started uh, the first sound system in 1955 in England, after he did Stowe from Bowden in a centre of 54. He was originally Tom the Great Sebastian. Oh, DJ, yeah. Who I mean, oh, choose with him. So, I mean, no, so yeah. a Latimer Road, Maxilla Club, and we are doing it as a commemoration theme, you know what I mean? Oh, and well, you know, so, if Bob, if Bob and was alive, he would have been 80 years old Monday. Monday, he would have been 80 years old if he was alive. Yeah, Bob and yeah, yeah, one of Jamaica's greatest um, writers. Sad. Yeah, man. <laughs> them thing there. And, and you know, me still vex so all man like Jackie Me Too, the organ genius with the reggae shuffle thing. And yeah. so many other than Drummond and all of them. I mm. know them don't get no honors. Yeah. Yeah. All people, no honors, no honors for the great works where so many of them do motor. Yeah. And we have to write that wrong by PMP and JLP and them thing there. And them are talking about scamming in Jamaica, the scamming thing. And yeah, same way to man, what he pass scamming in, in, in England. In, 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 in England. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> and guess what? The overwhelming majority of scamming. 76 percent were online delivered through social media sites. Most of them yes. online, man. All Jamaica to an online thing. Yeah, yeah man. You know? So who them, you. who them a catch more so with it? Who them a catch more? Nigeria and all Jamaica and all... Who no. Kurds well, well, them a fear, but no. Them a catch more a few them English people, but okay. them not like that. You know what I mean? Because them like blame Jamaicans and Nigerians. You know them where they? Yeah. Whether them more English people, them, yeah, man, uh, scamming is a way of life in Britain. <laughs> uh, did, did. Yeah, man, they have PhD in a scamming and them thing there. <laughs> well, you have some, it's that easier way to get some money in this mad time, yeah. Yeah, yes. Well, rather than actually kill people and them thing there, 
What a wicked thing that five people dead out of rock fort, man. Me feel it. Yeah. Eh? Well, let me lick, so, let me lick seven dollar there on a St. Catherine, uh, a St. Catherine or a Clarendon. You never hear about that? Clarendon, Clarendon are the um, place there near four parts. Them did kill yeah. a cherry tree lane and them thing there. But I yeah. me, 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 me tell you, man, it, 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 it really, really horrible, terrible, man. I mean, terrible, so me, terrible. when you look on the five pictures, and the five African them were dead out of Rockport, they out of East, man. Them, eh? them no claim say a, a man in a involved with the gang. Gang yes. kill gang. As I them I say. Yes. I don't know what I like so, them I say. But them they are the so-called gang, they were on to to deal with, with soldier and police. Instead of send them go a eh? Mm -hmm. eh? You know? Uh, anyway. And 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 six of one half a dozen of the other. PMP and GLP, Golden, Mark Golden, and him. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. I have to move, you know. I tell you, man, you know. We have to move. Yeah. All have right. And we want them out of, of, of Haiti. Yeah. All Haitian and Kenyan. All right? Yeah. I don't know if I'll come up here, so I'll come up here this month, next month still, or this month again, you know. We use up oh. half of England a little bit. It's, I mean, London especially. Yeah. We go I hope so. Yeah. I hope you just keep me posted. I hope, I hope yeah, you man. come through. You know what I mean? All right. We have to move. Give thanks. Yeah? All right. Blessed love, Mota. Blessed. Break time. Yeah. Break time. Sass round, yeah? Yes. We could play this. This way I play. Here we go. I think that we are witnessing a historical moment in the West's relationship with the entire world, not only with the South, with the entire world, including pockets in the North, because the West has discarded all its old pretenses from the Cold War era, all the notion about ideals of freedom and equality and freedom of speech and self-determination, all that is thrown out of the window. We are witnessing today the West as it is, as we in the left in the Arab world, when I was a young activist, were saying, and people did not believe us, don't believe their slogan. Don't believe their democracy. They don't care about self-determination or human rights at all. They use them as tools to subjugate the population. And we're seeing it today. No, but today, they suspended the discourse. And I think the time when Western officials and all these NGOs that Rani and I know about a lot in Lebanon, who co come and hold these workshops and conferences about freedom of speech and tolerance and the other point of view and coexistence, all that will be left at. I think the West today is more real than ever. It is the real West. It is not the Hollywood West. It is not the discourse West. And it took a Democrat president like Joe Biden to show the world of what the West is real like, which is fundamentally still a colonialist, racist, warmongering project inflicting death and injury over the entire world. Yes. That is really what is taking place right now. And some of we are going like we don't see say it to happen. It a handful right in front of it. And we don't realize what is taking place. We just continue so like some zombies. Like zombies. We go round and round and round. Trying to catch with TL. But there's something going on they don't want us to see. Just before this Israel-Palestine thing, there was this Russia-Ukraine thing that focused on this Russia-Ukraine thing, like that. And almost like someone flipped a switch, the entire world is just focused on this Israel-Palestine thing. People who didn't even know about Palestine, people who are unfamiliar, everyone is just focused on it. And while I stand for justice, and right now, while I stand for Palestine, at least based on what I'm allowed to know about the situation, there's something diabolical that's happening right now in this world that nobody's talking about. As we're speaking right now, there is a holocaust happening right now, 2023, in the Congos. Genocide, as we speak right now. Just to give you a bit of a backstory, the Congo is perhaps the most mineral-rich place 
on the planet and produces something called cobalt, coltan. I'm not sure if it's the same product, but it's in the same family. And this particular product is used on all cell phones, in computers, in all of our technical devices, electronic vehicles. Yeah, Tesla. Without this particular material, none of that would work. As we speak right now, there's a rebel army called M23 that is fighting against the Congolese military. This M23 rebel army is made up of soldiers from Rwanda and Uganda. Now, this war is causing instabilization in the Congo. So you understand any economy with that level of instability, you can steal from them, you can take what you want from them, you know, and there is this constant battle. Now, it will seem as though Africans fighting against Africans, right? So, like, why would Rwanda and Uganda send people to fight against the Congolese military to destabilize the Congo? It, it just doesn't make sense until you find out that the armies from Rwanda and Uganda are being financed by the USA, the UK, and France. Now, this is probably a good time to remind you that cobalt is the raw material used for all of our computers, aerospace engineering, electric vehicles, telephones. You guys beginning to understand the picture, right? Man, I really, really wanted to share some videos with you guys here, but because of the nature of the content that I share, right now my account is on warning status. You understand? So I gotta be careful. But I'm still going to give you information. Oh, TikTok, this is for entertainment purposes only. Now, in this war that is allegedly funded by the United States, the UK, and France, every single hour, about 50 to 60 women are SA. Already over 1 million people have been unalive, more than half of them kids. If we go back to the start of this conflict over 25 years ago, with over 6 million casualties, that would make this particular war the second largest since the Second World War. Yet, nobody knows about it. It's not on mainstream media. So it's quite clear to me that somebody doesn't want this information about what's going on in the Congos to be mainstream. Because I'm in the Caribbean, allow me to speak as well about Caribbean journalism which in my mind is a joke because we want to report things that Western media report. The only non-local news our local journalists ever report is things that CNN or ABC or NBC or one of those major guys report. We have no actual investigations ourselves outside of local that's not connected to mainstream Western media. And this is the reason why even our local Caribbean media houses are not pushing this kind of story. Guys, listen, the reason why I really want to be able to push this thing is because Hitler killed maybe about 2 million Jews, okay? And he is called the worst man in history. Leopold went to the Congos, that same place, and unalived over 20 million of the natives there. And up till today, Leopold's name isn't on the list of worst people in the world. There seemed to be a very structured effort to treat a certain type of people with less courtesy than others. Hey, I support the Palestines. I support I them. But while I'm messages. supporting the Palestines, there are people, human beings, right now that's suffering at a worse level than the Palestines are right now. And I'm not minimizing what the Palestines are going through at all. I mean, it, it grieves me to see what they're going through. But by God, how could we ignore what is happening in the Congo? I mean, I can't even show the videos on yes. here because oh, I'm afraid we... that my account will be banned. Well, like but guys, let us Congo. please give your support to the serious thing. We have to really understand where we are going at the Congo, you know. Millions of youth, I mean children, them use child labor along the like slave labor. Serious thing anyway. We ought to take a break. Chuck, my lovely people. Yeah, me I say no man, just do the right thing in you know, the people. Yeah, man, just like, share and subscribe and drop a comment in the comment section where are we upon let me know what you think about the topic let me know if you like the thumbnail let me know what you think you understand yeah man we catching you on our next one you understand step in razor tomorrow and so all you have to do you know people when you like it 
the algorithm show say you love it. So keep on doing the right thing. You understand? Blessings.